my friends, what a joy and a privilege it is to be here with all of you today, to share in this profound exploration of the power that lies within each and every one of us. You see, the message that I have for you today is one that has the potential to radically transform not just your own life, but the very fabric of our shared reality. And that message, my friends, is all about the transformative energy of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence. Now, I know what some of you might be thinking, Wayne, that sounds a little extreme, doesn't it? Why would I want to ghost everyone? And what do you mean by grinding in silence? Well, let me tell you, this is no small matter. This is about reclaiming your power, your sovereignty, and your rightful place as a co-creator of your own destiny. You see, in this modern world of ours, we are constantly bombarded with distractions, with demands, with a relentless need to be seen, to be validated, to be acknowledged by the world around us. And that, my friends, is a trap. It's a trap that far too many people have fallen into. And it's one that robs them of their true potential, their true purpose, and their ability to consciously shape the course of their lives. But not you, my friends. Not if you're willing to take a bold, decisive step forward and embrace the energy of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence. Because let me tell you, when you start to cultivate this mindset, when you start to consciously carve out the time and the space to focus on your own personal growth and development, the results can be truly mind-blowing. Doors start to open, opportunities start to present themselves and you find yourself moving through life with a grace, an ease, and an inspired action that may have once felt completely out of reach. And let me tell you, there is no greater feeling in the world than that. But here's the thing, my friends, this ain't about you know, seeking external validation, about trying to impress or outshine the people around you. No, this is about something far deeper, far more profound. This is about you becoming the architect of your own life, the CEO of your own destiny. It's about shedding the old, limiting beliefs that have been holding you back and stepping into the fullest, most authentic expression of who you truly are. And let me tell you, this work is not for the faint of heart. It's going to require you to face your deepest fears, to confront the demons that have been keeping you small, keeping you safe, keeping you from reaching your full potential. But when you do, when you start to peel back those layers and get to the core of who you are, the rewards are truly off the charts. Suddenly you realize that the only validation you've ever needed, the only self-worth you've ever required has been within you all along. It's like you've been carrying this treasure, this boundless well of power and potential, and you've just been waiting for the right moment to unlock it. And let me tell you, my friends, that moment is now. Because the world needs you, the world is begging for you to step up and become the embodied manifestation of this transformative energy. You see, at the deepest level, we're all connected. We are all part of the same vast interdependent web of energy and information. And when you start to shift your own personal frequency, when you start to align yourself with the higher vibration of self-trust, self-discipline, and inner peace, you send out a ripple effect that has the power to transform not just your own life, but the lives of those around you as well. It's like you're becoming a beacon, a lighthouse, shining your light out into the world and inspiring others to do the same. And as more and more of us start to embody this energy, as we start to consciously work on forging these unbreakable habits of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence, we create a critical mass of transformation that has the potential to change the very fabric of our society, our culture, and our world. Because my friends, at the end of the day, this isn't just about you. This isn't just about achieving some specific goal or outcome. No, this is about something so much bigger, so much more profound. This is about you becoming a vessel for the highest, most powerful energies of love, joy, and It's about you stepping up and saying, enough is enough. I'm done settling for anything less than the fullest, most authentic expression of who I truly am. And when you make that choice, when you start to embody that energy, the world around you has no choice but to respond. Doors start to open, opportunities start to present themselves, and you find yourself moving through life with a grace and ease, and an inspired action that may have once felt completely out of reach. But it's not just about you, my friends. No, this is about all of us coming together in this collective mission of self-discovery and self-actualization. Because as more and more of us start to do the same, as we start to shed the old, 
to embrace the new and to step into the fullest, most authentic expression of who we truly are. We'll start to see the walls crumbling, the old paradigm shifting, and a new world emerging before our very eyes. It's like we're becoming the architects of a better future, the visionaries who are shaping the world that our children and grandchildren will inherit. And let me tell you, my friends, there is no greater purpose, no greater calling than that. So let's get to work. Let's roll up our sleeves, let's dig deep, and let's start making our families proud. Because the truth is the world needs us. The world is begging for us to step up and become the embodied manifestation of this transformative age. And when we do, when we start to ignite that flame within our loved ones, when we start to inspire them to unlock their own inner reservoirs of power and potential, the possibilities are truly endless. The sky's the limit, my friends, and the time to act is now. So let's not waste another moment. Let's go out there and make it happen. Let's rewrite the story. Let's, let's shatter the limitations. And let's become the change we wish to see in the world. Because when we do, my friends, the world will never be this. Now I know what some of you might be thinking. When Wayne, how can I possibly do all of this? How can I possibly summon the courage and the commitment to take on such a monumental task? Let me tell you, that's a damn good question. Because the truth is, ghosting everyone and grinding in silence, cultivating that deep, unwavering sense of self-trust and inner authority is not something that's going to happen overnight. It's a lifelong journey, a constant process of growth, evolution, and self-discovery. But you know what? That's precisely what makes it so powerful, so transformative. Mm -hmm. Because when you commit to this work, when you make the decision to step up and become the fullest, most authentic expression of who you truly are, you're not just changing your own life. But no, my friends, you're changing the world. You see, the thing is, we live in a world that's constantly trying to keep us small, to keep us confined within the narrow limits of what's acceptable or normal. And for far too long, we've been conditioned to believe that we're nothing more than the sum total of our past experiences, our genetic predispositions, and the external circumstances that have shaped our lives. Or that, my friends, is a lie. Because the truth is we are so much more than that. We are dynamic, ever-evolving beings with the capacity to consciously shape and direct the course of our lives. And when we learn to harness this power, when we start to tap into the boundless well of creativity, intelligence, and intuition that lies within us, the possibilities become truly limitless. It's like we're tapping into a higher frequency, a greater intelligence that's been there all along, just waiting for us to tune in and align with it. And as we do this, as we start to shift our own personal vibration and consciousness, we begin to attract new opportunities, new insights, and new ways of being that were previously outside of our reach. But here's the thing. This ain't about sitting back and waiting for things to happen. No, this is about taking radical ownership, about becoming the CEO of your own life. It's about consciously cultivating the habits, the mindsets, and the disciplines that keep you grounded, centered, and in a constant state of growth and evolution. Because let me tell you, my friends, it, the journey to ghosting everyone and grinding in silence is not an easy one. It's gonna require you to dig deep, to face your fears, to confront the demons that have been holding you back for far too long. But when you do, when you start to unlock that inner reservoir of power and potential, the rewards are truly off the charts. Suddenly, you find yourself moving through life with a grace and an ease that may have once felt completely out of reach. Doors start to open, opportunities start to present themselves, and you realize that the only thing standing in your way is the limiting beliefs and self-imposed barriers that you've been carrying around with you for far too long. And let me tell you, the moment you start to let go of those old, outdated ways of thinking, the moment you start to consciously cultivate the habits and mindsets of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence, that's when the real magic starts to happen. I mean, you see, my friends, when you make the decision to step up and become the fullest, most authentic expression of who you truly are, you're not just changing your own life. No, you're changing the world. You're becoming a beacon, a lighthouse, shining your light out into the darkness and inspiring others to do the same. And as more and more of us start to embody this energy, as we start to consciously work on forging these unbreakable habits of self-trust, self-discipline and inner peace, 
we create a critical mass of transformation that has the power to rewrite the very fabric of our society, our culture, and our world. It's like we're becoming the architects of a better future, the visionaries who are shaping the world that our children and grandchildren will inherit. And let me tell you, my friends, there is no greater purpose, no greater calling than that. And now I know what some of you might be thinking, hmm, but Wayne, how can I possibly do all of this? How can I possibly summon the courage and the commitment to take on such a monumental task? And let me tell you, that's a damn good question. Because the truth is, ghosting everyone and grinding in silence, cultivating that deep, unwavering sense of self-trust and inner authority is not something that's going to happen overnight. It's a lifelong journey, a constant process of growth, evolution, and self-discovery. I'm like, but you know what? You know, what's precisely what makes it so powerful, so transformative? Because when you commit to this work, when you make the decision to step up and become the fullest, most authentic expression of who you truly are, you're not going to know, my friends, you're changing the world. You see, the thing is, we live in a world that's constantly trying to keep us small, to keep us confined within the narrow limits of what's acceptable or normal. And for far too long, we've been conditioned to believe that we're nothing more than the sum total of our past experiences, our genetic predispositions, and the external circumstances that have shaped our lives. Uh, but that, my friends, is a lie. Because yeah. the truth is we are so much more than that. We are dynamic, ever-evolving beings with the capacity to consciously shape and direct the course of our lives. And when we learn to harness this power when we start to tap into the boundless well of creativity, intelligence, and intuition that lies within us, the possibilities become truly limitless. It's like we're tapping into a higher frequency, uh, greater intelligence that's been there all along, just waiting for us to tune in and align with it. And as we do this, as we start to shift our own personal vibration and consciousness, we begin to attract new opportunities, new insights, and new ways of being that were previously outside of our reach. But here's the thing, this ain't about sitting back and waiting for things to happen. No, this is about taking radical ownership, about becoming the CEO of your own life. It's about consciously cultivating the habits, the mindsets, and the disciplines that keep you grounded, centered, and in a constant state of growth and evolution. Because let me tell you, my friends, the journey to ghosting everyone and grinding in silence is not an easy one. It's going to require you to dig deep, to face your fears, to confront the demons that have been holding you back for far too long. But when you do, when you start to unlock that inner reservoir of power and potential, the rewards are truly off the charts. Suddenly, you find yourself moving through life with a grace and an ease that may have once felt completely out of reach. Doors start to open. Opportunities start to present themselves. And you realize that the only thing standing in your way is the limiting beliefs and self-imposed barriers that you've been carrying around with you for far too long. And let me tell you, the moment you start to let go of those old, outdated ways of thinking, the moment you start to consciously cultivate the habits and mindsets of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence, that's when the real magic starts to happen. Because you see, when you commit to this work, when you make the decision to step up and become the fullest, most authentic expression of who you truly are. You're not just changing your own life. No, you're changing the world. You're becoming a beacon, a uh, lighthouse, signing your light out into the darkness and inspiring others to do the same. And as more and more of us start to embody this energy, as we start to consciously work on forging these unbreakable habits of self-trust, self-discipline, and inner peace, we create a critical mass of transformation that has the power to rewrite the very fabric of our society, our culture, and our world. It's like we're becoming the architects of a better future, the visionaries who are shaping the world that our children and grandchildren will inherit. And let me tell you, my friends, there is no greater purpose, no greater calling than that. So let's get to work. Let, let's roll up our sleeves, let's dig deep, and let's start making our, our families proud. Because the truth is, the world needs us. The world is begging for us to step up and become the embodied manifestation of this transformative energy. And when we do, when we start to ignite that flame within our loved ones, when we start to inspire them to unlock their own inner reservoirs of power and potential, the possibilities are truly endless. The sky's the limit, my friends, and the time to act is now.
So let's not waste another moment. Let's go out there and make it happen. Let's rewrite the story. Let's shatter the limitations and let's become the change we wish to see in the world. Because when we do, my friends, the world will never be the same. And now I know that for some of you, this may all sound a bit lofty, a bit too out there. You might be thinking, Wayne, this is great and all, but how do I actually put this into practice? How do I go about ghosting everyone and grinding in silence in a way that's practical and sustainable? And let me tell you, that's a the mm. fantastic question because the truth is this isn't just about some abstract esoteric concept. No, this is about creating tangible real world results in your life. And to do that, you're going to need to develop some very specific habits and mindsets. First and foremost, you're going to need to get really, really clear on your priorities. Because uh, let's face it, in this uh, fast paced, hyper connected world of ours, it's easy to get pulled in a million different directions. We've got work demands, social obligations, family responsibilities, and uh, never ending stream of digital distractions all vying for our time and attention. And that, my friends, is the um, antithesis of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence. Because in order to truly tap into that transformative power, you're going to need to be laser focused, ruthlessly uh, selective about where you invest your energy and your resources. So I want you to ask yourself, what are the things that truly matter to you? What are the goals, the dreams, the aspirations that light you up from the inside out? And um, how can you start to ruthlessly eliminate or delegate everything else so that you can pour your heart and soul into those core priorities? But no, I know it might sound a little extreme, and trust me, I get it. It's not always easy to say no, to set boundaries, to carve out that dedicated time and space for your own personal growth and development. But let me tell you, my friends, it is absolutely essential if you want to unlock the fullest, most authentic expression of who you truly are. Because when you start to streamline your life in this way, when you start to ruthlessly guard your time and your energy, something magical starts to happen. You find yourself becoming more focused, more productive, more resilient in the face of challenges and obstacles. And as you start to see those tangible, real world results manifesting in your life, something else starts to shift as well. Your self-trust, your self-belief, your sense of inner authority and sovereignty starts to grow and blossom in ways you may have never thought possible. You see, my friends, when you make the decision to ghost everyone and grind in silence, you're not just changing your external circumstances. No, you're embarking on a profound alchemical process of inner transformation that has the power to shift your entire energetic signature your very way of being in the world. It's like you're shedding the old, outdated skin and stepping into a new, more vibrant, more expansive version of yourself. And as you do this, as you start to cultivate that unwavering self-trust and inner authority, you begin to attract new opportunities, new relationships, and new ways of being that were previously outside of your reach. Suddenly, the world around you starts to shift and realign in ways that feel almost magical. Doors open, synchronicities abound, and you find yourself moving through life with a grace, an ease, and an inspired action that may have once felt completely unattainable. And let me tell you, my friends, uh. there is no greater feeling in the world than that, because when you start to live from that place of deep, unshakable self-trust, when you become the embodied manifestation of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence, you're not just changing your own life. No, you're changing the very fabric of our... Uh, shared reality. You're becoming a beacon, a lighthouse, shining your light out into the darkness and inspiring others to do this. And as more and more of us start to embody this transformative energy, as we start to consciously work on forging these unbreakable habits of self-mastery and inner peace, we create a critical mass of positive change that has the power to reshape our world. It's like we're becoming the architects of a better future, the visionaries who are shaping the world that our children and grandchildren will inherit. And let me tell you, my friends, there is no greater purpose, no greater calling than that. So let's get to work. Let's roll up our sleeves. Let's dig deep. And let's start making our families proud. Because the truth is, the world needs us. The world is begging for us to step up and become the embodied manifestation of this transformative energy. And when we do, when we start to ignite that flame within our loved ones, 
when we start to inspire them to unlock their own inner reservoirs of power and, and potential, the possibilities are truly endless. The sky's the limit. My friends, and the time to act is now. So let's not waste another moment. Let's go out there and make it happen. Let's rewrite the story. Let's shatter the limitations. And let's become the change we wish to see in the world. Because when we do, my friends, the world will never be the same. Thank you all for being here today, for opening your hearts and minds to this profound exploration of the power that lies within each and every one of us. Let's go forth and make it happen, my friends. The future is ours to shape and the time to act is now. Bless you all and may the energy of ghosting everyone and grinding in silence be with you always. Namaste.